Hello everyone, my name is Megan, and this is Gal Pash. And uh, yeah, just a quick warning about this game. Um, it is... It deals with mental health and psychosis, so if that is a problem for you, then just be aware of that before you watch me play this game. Um, so I'm going to actually turn this down just a smidge. So I know that this is not typical of my content here on this channel, but um, I started playing this game, uh, Hellblade Sinua's uh, Sacrifice, and I only got about 30 minutes in, but I had to stop because this game is just fucking beautiful. Like, it, this this is a work of art, and I was like, I need, I need to record this just because, like, this is an experience, and so I would love to be able to play this and if you're interested to to play along with me because this game is absolutely stunning um and it's it's not that long of a game i've been told um so there's that but i i needed to record myself playing this <laughs> and to share it because i want more people to know about it and uh to play it as well so i'm gonna start from the beginning again uh like i said i did not get that far so it's really not that much of a replay for me but so don't worry, I'll be getting into, you know, new stuff for me very shortly. But, so I'm going to start a new game. Uh, so you guys can see the beauty of, of this, this video game. And it's just beautiful. So let's go. Let's start. Y yes, I know. It's fine. But yeah, so um, this is pretty much just going to be low-key, just me playing. Uh, I might in future sessions put my face in the corner but it is a sunday afternoon and i am a lazy ass today and <laughs> i'm not fit to be in front of people so my voice is good enough hello who are you Safe with me. I'll be right here, nice and close, so I can speak without alerting the others. Let me tell you about Senua. For her story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. What's happening? It's breathing. What the head? It's breathing. It's breathing. I highly recommend that you guys wear headphones, oh, me. if possible, because there's 3D I never told audio. You, the others. you hear them too, right? They've been around ever since the tragedy. Well, that's not quite true. Some are old, some are new, but they've changed. I think the darkness changed them, just like it changed her. And this character, this character is, um, from Northern Scotland. Look, up ahead. Do you see it too? You promise? Oof. Yes. <clears throat> it is real after all. She's finally arrived in the land of mist and fog. The place the Northern. Code leads? Good job. Good job on this fucking coding, cause damn. Yeah, they're in the water. Look around and you will see them. The drowned. The sick. The slain. Here they lie, rotting in the fields and rivers of hell. But the dead don't always lie still here. 
I should mention this game's a bit dark, <laughs> so if, if that's not your your deal, then yeah. They're going to do that to you. Can you see them? Can you see them? They're going to do that to you. <laughs> They're watching. Stop. Can you feel them watching? They're watching us. So these are all voices in her head, <clears throat> and I suppose that in this game we are one of those voices, so we're, we're with her on this journey she's taking, which is, I think, a beautifully artistic perspective in the game. She's afraid, wouldn't you be? You'd think she would get used to it by now after so many years. It just builds onto itself, growing stronger, towering over her. You might try and ignore it, turn away. But it's always there, just out of sight, where you're most vulnerable. It's like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see it suffocating. Yeah, the woman who, who performs this character, uh, Melina, I'm not going to butcher your last name, but phenomenal so you far. I think she's brave to go on this journey on her own. <clears throat> but it isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Said it was fear runs far. I wonder if there's a way I could turn on subtitles, but I don't, I don't know. I'll have to see in a second. What is she looking at? Too late to get into the boat and go back. Mm -hmm. No one will judge her. No one will ever know. Oh, she heard us. There's no going back. Oops. You can't do well, my... pushes away a world that conspired to cause so much suffering. My cats are being fed, so that's their machine. There's nothing to go back to, and worse to look forward to. So y'all get to hear my cats being fed. Why don't you join us? Maybe yeah. you too have a part to play in this story. Yes, because we're controlling her character. Okay, so here we are. So this is, uh, this is our girl, Senua. And, um, the art is stunning Look, right up here. really clearly focus Senua. focus do not forget my story Senua. because your darkness comes from hell and your fate lies there they say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to hell's gate but gods and the living mm. will follow this path you must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea. Yes, my cats are being fed. And down They're the loud. Dark okay, let's After go. After nine nights of riding, you will follow a great river. Yes, yes. Pretty much that's just him telling you how to find this place. And I'm hurrying forward because, uh...
And here we are. Knives across which lies the halls of hell, the place they call Hellheim. Yep, that's her lover's head. We're on a mission to save her dear beloved. Mm -hmm. Dillian. Okay. Let's go get our boyfriend. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? Why doesn't she turn back? So the whole game, these voices are like kind of tricking you like they're it's sometimes it sounds like they're trying to help you out and other times it sounds like you're they're trying to like doubt you and freak you out she forgets too but she does remember that only the dead may cross it oh, am i tired <laughs> Okay. As I said, I played this part already, so I remember how to get there, but uh, not much further past this, I don't. The Northmen speak of nine worlds. The world of men they call Midgard. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of Earth, Harvest, Wind, and Sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of ice mm. and darkness. Only the dead dwell in Helheim. Gorgeous game. And that is where you must travel. Absolutely gorgeous. So yeah, this whole, like, she's dealing with her demons and, you know, pushing through it anyway. It's beautiful. Touch it. I'm not one of them. I was just hiding. I find I live longer. That way. Please let the bastards catch me again. Never! Wait. Who are you? Just a memory. Drew? Is that you? How old are you now? For my tales of the Northmen, they call me Drew. A liar. He's lost. An old fool. <laughs> Truth is my truth. Huh? It's good to see you again. You kept your vow. To guide you in this life and the next. Hmm. Yep. I will tell you my stories of hell if I may walk with you. Tell me the stories again, old friend. I'm so. Listening. It was his guidance that led her to know how to get to this place in the first place. Focus your inner eye, and you okay. too will see 
what's hidden in plain sight. Focus. I can see one. Keep at it. Yeah, yeah, I know where to get this one. There it is. You will find it. Oh. Look towards the gate. And the gate will open. Oh, is there already? Yep, there we go. That was an easy one. I spent six years enslaved in hell, but I watched the Northmen, learned their ways. I know you did. You listen when everyone else laughed. Mm -hmm. My people paid the heavy price. Carry my stories with you. And together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. Oh boy. I don't like this part. Actually, I really don't like the part that's coming up because the first time I tried it, I fell. I fell to my death, and I don't like it. She wants to try to make them go away. Pretend they weren't real. What good is that? But we are always here. Yeah, so the dude, um... He tried to warn the her people about I think it was her people about the Northmen who I think are supposed to be the Vikings. It's the same with heights. Uh, I suck. The edge. I suck at this. I Tell suck at this. To be okay. Come on, go forward. Go forward. But you know that death is near. Uh, uh, go 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. You can get it. All right. I hate that. I fell the first time I tried it. Whew. The world of the dead is ruled by the giantess, Hela, daughter of Loki. Hela. The gods feared her bloodline. Kate Blanchett? On her side and yet much worse on her father's. So, as a child... The All Father cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over those who die of sickness, age, hardship, and self slaughter. In all of the nine worlds, only Hela can resurrect the dead. To Hela, your Dillion was sacrificed, and with her, you must bargain. Yep. Which is why I'm carrying his head with me so this is about as far as I went so woo let's go look at it you have to open it the gate to Helheim divides the living from the dead is that the face of Hela herself the half rotten goddess that walks over Helheim that bitch whatever horrors lie behind that door she must find him. Shh. So it's here. Yeah, so she's she's fighting with her um, her mind. Um, no? 
Um, what? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh no! Oh shit! All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the? F <laughs> oh what? Actually, while I'm here, uh, subtitles. There we go. Perfect. Cool guys. I'm getting us uh, subtitles. All right. All right. Fast strike. Heavy strike. Melee attack. Block. Evade. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Hit. Oh, no. Shut up. Yeah. Oh, shit. Shit. Nah. Heavy strike. Go. Arr. Fuck him up. Yeah, bitch. Yeah. Yes. Oh, shit. Ah. Get him. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Yeah! Mm. I like the mechanics. Oh my god. Yes. Yes. Fin finish it. Oh. Oh no. Uh, uh, uh. Evade. 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 Um, how am I supposed to beat that? Um. Shit. Shit? Yeah, thanks for letting me know that they're winning. Thank you. Um... Uh... Um... Uh... Um... Well, that was a short game. <laughs> hmm. That looks rough. Oh, okay. A vision of what's to come. Poor Senua. The darkness does not bargain. It does not reason. It is rot. Mm. And now it has taken hold. It will spread towards her head, the seed of the soul, until there is nothing left of her. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Don't scratch at it. Ah! All of her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. Oh. Yeah, I'd be pissed too. Um... The dark rot will grow each time you fail. Cool. Nice. If the rot reaches Senua's head, her quest is over. Cool. Okay. And all pro- oh shit, all progress will be lost. Oh no. Okay. Well? Cool. The hardest battles are fought in the mind. That is what Dillian taught her. With every defeat, the dark rot will grow and soon it will take her soul. But for now, at least, she still has control of her mind. And she will fulfill her vow. Whatever the cost. Hmm. <sighs> Side note, I would love to see a cosplay of her. I would love it. Listen to me, Senua. The goddess Hela lies behind the gate to Helheim. To open the gate, you must first face the gods that guard it. Mm -hmm. The god of fire, Zut, Fire. and the god of illusion, oh. Helraven. Spill okay. your blood to open the gate to Helheim and enter the land of the dead. 
Okay. It won't open. How will she get through? Why won't it open? Why can't she open it? She needs to challenge the gods. She has to fight two gods first. Two gods. I love how the voices are bickering amongst themselves. The Northmen say that in the beginning there was nothing but darkness. Bitter cold to the north, fiery hot to the south. They say the cold hmm. formed ice, which melted from the sparks from the south. Hmm. The power of the darkness gave life to the dripping ice, and the first giant was born, hmm. and was named Emir. Emir. The ice continued to drip, and the power of the void gave life to it, and it became a cow whose milk fed the giant. That's right, a cow. But you weren't expecting that. <laughs> I was not. All right. Well, I am gonna end it. Oh, oh no, 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 no. I, uh, I was going to not walk in yet. I was going to end the video here. Okay. Sort. The fire giant has answered. Uh-oh. He comes from a land older than mankind. And the Northmen call upon his flaming sword to raise their enemies to the ground. Oof. And spill his blood. All right. Hell yeah, I will. Until then, I'm going to end it right here because she found the uh old fool on her way back from the wild. Stop going into story. I need to take a break. <laughs> His back had burnt all over. Mhm. Mm she took pity on him. For he was not long for this world. Oh. Like her. We spoke of his own darkness. Hmm. The Northman. So he he is just a so that's the guy who's narrating is the the gentleman that you found at the first gate so he's long dead but he um told her all these stories and so he's kind of guiding her through her journey after his death and everything so but i love it i love this game so far it's dark it's gritty but it's beautiful and i love all of it and um yeah so i hope that you choose to take this this journey with me as I keep playing this game. Um, and uh, yeah, so let me know what you think of the game in the comments, if you want me to include a camera <laughs> with, with me or if just my voice is okay. Um, I, honestly, I think that adding my, because I know that some um, people who play games on YouTube will put their uh, the camera in the corner, but honestly, I think it would detract from the the game itself because you kind of have to take in the game kind of as a whole whole thing um so I, I i'm cool with just using my voice but um but yeah thank you for for playing along with me and i hope to see you guys in the next video thanks guys bye